Today, the official word from the Department of Justice was almost too much for the family of Alton Sterling to bear. I just want justice to be served for him. No federal civil rights charges against the two Baton Rouge police officers involved in his death, including Officer Blaine Salamone. Word of the decision leaked yesterday, and Sterling's aunt is furious she wasn't told first. Salamone put that gun in his head and said, I'm going to kill you. Last July, a 911 caller told police someone matching Sterling's description had pulled a gun outside a convenience store. The officers are seen wrestling him to the ground. The family says investigators today revealed more about what led up to the shooting. He took his gun and put it to Alter Sterling's head and said, I'll kill you. The U.S. attorney did not address that allegation in his public comments, but there's a higher bar to prove intent. Insufficient evidence exists to charge either officer with a federal crime. Overnight, peaceful protesters gathered where Sterling was killed. The hardest part would be not to be able to see his face again, not to be able to hear his voice or get that phone call. His teenage son disappointed with the Fed's decision, but hopeful that a newly opened state investigation might bring justice. Gabe Gutierrez, NBC News, Baton Rouge.